Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, <laughs> Let's go have ourselves a nice cup of tea. All hail the great cup of tea. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Sorry. Time to get down. Wait. Oh, my luggage. Oh, for heaven's sakes, Luna. Why is everyone staring at us? Slayers! Slayers! All hail Slayers! As for gold and a good of sheets! And they shall flip them on you in a fire. And they shall lift the great kappa. And shall abscond with the great kappa. Never to be seen again. What? Hey! Wahoo! Hey, wait, my tea, come back. Don't worry, we'll find a nice quiet place to drink it for you. First, we have to find the way out. <sighs> That's so typical of those two. Do you think they'll even save our drop for the rest of us? Not likely. Don't worry, we're still here for you. Every step of the way. We won't leave your side for a minute. Oh goody. How reassuring. Look out! Ah, ah lovers! Where'd they come from? <sighs> <sighs> they got some of my luggage! Up here, on top of the book! Up here! Up here! You, up here. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> This is so easy. Take my hand. Take it. Take it. Come on, come on. What about my luggage? Hang tight. Hang tight. Hang tight. The crowd's bound to disperse. As soon as the selectors find that back door. Well, the crowd lynches them. Whichever comes first. Up you go. Up you go. Come on. They couldn't even fly me up. No, you people. Back. There is no more room up here! You can let us up at least! You owe us that for not kicking your suits out! Come on! Quick! Thanks. Thanks. But that's it! Get off! Let go! Don't kick at the crowd then! Get off! You nearly got the salmon! Just go away! Yeah, watch that! Hey! Your leg! It's fine! She's healed! She's healed! All hail the Great Kappa and the Book of Cheats. Ah, 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 ah. She's not healed. She was never sick in the first place. See? She's healed. She's healed. She's healed. You can't get sick or injured here. What? It's the afterlife. What? Know anyone else who's incapacitated? And I took a tumble too. And I fell on top of her. But I'm fine. Hmm. Luna, you can carry your own luggage from now on. But what am I going to do now? Who's going to help me? Guess you're going to have to help yourself. But I was happy when I was injured. Even on Earth. I had all those allergies, and I was always getting colds and flu, and there was all that stress. People did everything for me. How am I ever going to be happy now that I'm well? Mm. Rick, the crowd's following this Legna's into the antechamber. This is our big chance. Let's get out of here. Come on. <laughs> Wait a minute. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. We could look in the book of cheats. Maybe we can find some tips. No. Yeah, no let's go. Go. Let's go. go. Come on, help me open it. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. This is blank. What? what? These are blank pieces of paper. No, they can't be. Wait. No. You're right. These last pages. There's something on them. Quick, before they get back, what does it say? What does it say? What does it say? It says... Mm -hmm. Rule number one. Yes? Yes. yes? yes! There are... 
no rules. That's it. That's all that's on here. Well, except for this bit that says no refunds. No rules? But that makes that a rule, saying there are no rules. Which means that no rules is a rule. Uh, I think I'm going to self-destruct. Or we could take a very long adjournment. That's an idea. Quick, they're coming back. Wait a minute. Right here, after the last page. Look! look! A door! A, a door! door. door. Oh, look, 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 look. Let's go through it. Let's get out of here. Oh. No! That's the place where no one dares go. There are cats in there. There's... And more socks and... And Robert suits. And cats. And coffee. <laughs> and no chocolates. Oh, no! He's halfway through already! Get him out of there! I've got his feet! <laughs> Come on! Everybody! Everybody pull! Pull! pull. pull. <laughs> Come on! Yeah. Well, look, look at, at that! that. Yeah. I'll be darned! <laughs> Don't scare me like that again! <gasps> <laughs> no, no, they're heading for the choir loft. <laughs> Let's go! Run away! <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> Nothing. No, what exactly did you see? <laughs> Nothing at all! What? You're, you're saying nothing? <laughs> That's spooky. I'm out of here. There was nothing! Look! No! no! Well, that's not what I would call nothing. Wow. It's beautiful. There you go. The blue box. The blue box? That's not the blue box. That's Earth. Home. Well, it's blue, isn't it? Really, it's more of an aquamarine. Pearl blue. But it's a planet. It's round. Who says the box has to be square? It's, it's so, so beautiful. beautiful. Yeah. It is. Well, it's time to leave the results of your entrance exams there. I think I already did. What? I've already left my results behind. There. In the blue box. Oh dear, I think it's been too long without that too. Or oh, he's been putting the milk in last. His milk's totally expired. Leave your results behind in the blue box. I was in the blue box. Now I'm not. I can leave it all behind. Let's just close this, shall we? On second thought, what's with you and these doors? No! No! no, no wait, wait, wait! Wait! Don't, don't do, do it. it! Bye! No! Who's gonna help me? Okay. I'm gonna open my eyes now. Pink, pink skies. Smiling cartoon sun. Not a fish. Not a scale. Not a pot belly. And not one cranky blade of grass. And a park bench to sit on. <sighs> Perfect. Hey, look! 
a nice hot cup of tea. I'm glad we've settled that. The brilliant idiots of Where God Went Wrong have been Michael Steele, your main dead guy, grass, cows, phlegnas, a suit, more cows, ducks, the colonel, the intel officer, and the old man. Kareen Friesen was your narrator. Hey, that's me. Also, the doubtful salmon, phlegnas, the bench sergeant, the rule master. Seven, Aunt Mabel, plus the arguing couple, and a globbert or two. Laura Carlson urged us on as the main slegna, was a bunch more slegnas, cows, ducks, cricketers, a concerned citizen, an annoyed citizen, and the old woman with the globbert. Ian Carlson was the cafe proprietor, the tea vendor, a suit, and that strange fellow offering Aunt Mabel some tea. Rick Carlson was the bench and the priest. Alex Steele debuted as grass, snit fidgets, cows, ducks, an annoyed citizen, and the even more annoying sentinel and guardian computers. Emily Carlson was featured as the cats. The music in the story of Aunt Mabel was by Lorne DiGiorgi. Theme music by Jason Am, courtesy of Solvent. Take it away, Jason.